rendering wireframes in Redshift. Let's go. I have a bust here with a Redshift material applied to it. And in my nose, I'm going to go ahead and search for a wireframe and drop this in. If we put this to our output, you can see it's going to outline all the polygons we have. We have diagonal intersecting polygons, and that's because we have show hidden edges turned off. If we turn this off, our polygons will now be uniform. And we can go ahead and change our thickness of our lines, as well as our line color and our background color. If you want acting reflections and shadows on this, I can go ahead and add this to my diffuse color and then put this to my output. But what if we want to combine this with another texture that we have? So I'm going to go ahead and grab a color composite and put to the wireframe in my blends color and then put this to my diffuse color on my material. I'm going to go ahead and grab a random texture that I have and put this as my base color. So you see, this is a, a weave texture that I have. Uh, if we set our wireframe background color to black and then make this color composite mode to screen, it's just going to add the lines in on top of this. You can also go ahead and create a custom AOV to render out your wireframe separately without interfering with any of your materials. To do this, I've gone ahead and created a simple wireframe material here, uh, like I just showed you. And if I go up to my render settings and go to AOV under Redshift, I can go quick add and add a custom AOV. And if we go into here, we want to make sure that we rename this to wireframe. Under direct output, we're going to click enable, turn our data type to RGBA and turn our format to PNG. So we enable transparent and alpha backgrounds. And under our default material here, we're going to drag our wireframe material in. So now this will render out separately, but also in our IPR, we can click our drop down menu here and change this to wireframe. And you can see a wireframe without changing any of your materials. Hope that was helpful.